Hello friends, this is Mohamed Shakil here and in this tutorial series I'm going to demonstrate how you can create a shade metal component which you can see on the right side by using dimension drawings which you can see on the left. So we are on the second part of this tutorial series and we have just created a basic wall and I've explained the basic criteria of how you can read this drawing here. So the next thing you need to work on is to create a lower stamp. So to create a lower stamp you need to basically have a sketch and uh, the dimensions which are required for making the sketch is available here alright now to create that firstly you could go for a centered rectangle and just place a rectangle there and now this particular dimension is uh, try to read it well, it's just, uh, we'll do it lastly. Let's see. Now, this particular dimension here, this one, is uh, 8. And this one is 60. Just look closely. Yeah, here you have the 2.5. Just this one is 2.5. And you got the sketch being constrained here. Make sure that it's properly constrained by just taking this, trying to move it. Okay, it's 60 here as we have used the centered rectangle we didn't have to dimension it from here so that's cool just come out of the sketch and now create the lower stamp go for the lower stamp which is uh, available on insert stamping and lower stamp now select th select the sketch firstly and select the opening so basically you need the opening over here facing the outer edge and just you need to Oh, reverse the direction. So, what you can do is uh, you could have sketched it on the other face. Also, what you can do is just cancel it and come here in this face, give sketch, and then project these lines. This gives uh, me room to explain more of the things while you're working. Now you can hide this. Now you can go for the lower stamp and select this and select this edge as the opening edge and you got the lower stamp there. Now while giving the uh, different parameters for the lower stamp you need to make sure that you are properly going through the drawings because there are radius 1, radius 2, etc. while you are giving the lower stamp. So, firstly, here on the height you need to set 2 and uh, here it's 0, 90 degrees and radius, radius 1 is 2 and radius 2 is 1 which is here and here, R2 and R1. So everything else is uh, just as it is. So make sure you're giving all these values and you can see all these values here. If there was a particular kind of inclination we have been mentioned, then we, we should have been uh, giving different angles here. And the height is already mentioned here. So that explains all of the things. Just click on OK and you got the lower stamp there. So that's about creating a lower stamp and uh, let's see what is to be created next to see how we can complete the design like this one so i hope you enjoyed this tutorial and i hope i hope this tutorial series will be helping you on your sheet metal projects and if you have any doubt you could write to me you could comment below the video and if you have any cat projects you could write to me at kitsia.prodotuser at gmail.com thank you so much for watching and stay tuned